Yeah. We will continue our control wiring for the three phase uh, DOL uh, motor control. So let's start with our power first wire main supply to MCB. Take from MCB red color as uh, our first phase or from your MCB connect to load side and direct connect to connect to your MCB single phase motor control main power Next, we will do the neutral as well. Next wire, neutral for the control. So we have terminal here. So for the terminal, and connect to your main neutral. So we have we have two twenty already for your control power. 20 main source then next wire from circuit breaker load side to NC95 to your uh, auxiliary contact so auxiliary contact first breaker here auxiliary contact 95 NC first wire second wire from 95 NC to your auxiliary contact to loop to 98 in O or 98 normally open so open it like this from 98 in o loop to 22 nc so nc 22 then loop to 90 98 Next wire from NC terminal twenty one from terminal NC number twenty one on your contactor connect to your LED stop stop means red or off X one terminal X one. LED stop X1 to contactor NC or number 21. So I have this wire already. Next wire 13 and O on your contactor. Connect to LED run X1. X1 is here. one LED run X1 to NO number 13 on your contact wall. our next wire is from NO number 13 on your contact wall. loop to contactor A1 terminal 
A1 for coil power. So, small wire. From number 13 terminal in your contact door. Call NO. Loop to A1. A1 on your conductor. Just the small wire. So we have already hit. And the next wire from A1 contactor connect to your push button X3. Run push button. So this from A1 connect to start number terminal 3 X3. So long wire. From A1 Doctor A1 terminal Contactor A1 terminal connect to your start push button number terminal X3 on the top of the switch here A1 to start push button X3 then our next wire from NO number 14 on your on your contactor number 14 NO connect to run push button X4 so from number 14 in your contactor here number 14 NO in your contactor connect to push button run push button run X4 So we have the already the connection here. Then our next one, our next wire push button run terminal X4 loop to push button stop terminal X2. So from here push button run X4 connect together like this and here push button run X4 loop to another switch stop X2 terminal 2 NC96 on uh, oxalate contact 96 to push button stop terminal 1 so from here to here stop push button to NC96 on your contactor so from 96 connect to your stop push button terminal on the top or X1 So our post button is completed already from NC96 to X1 stop push button. The next wire, our next wire from 97 from your uh, auxiliary contact 97 NO connect to yellow one trip LED indicator. So from 97 from 97 
on your auxiliary contact contactor connect to yellow indicator or trip indicator it is wiring already now our next wiring we have to put neutral x or uh, a2 coil neutral so the black wire will start from here two wire so from your main neutral control neutral huh? connect to contactor a2 so it should be two wire A2 coil neutral contactor coil neutral and one wire will go to your door so this all indicator LED indicator you should put the neutral first neutral so first neutral Top indicator neutral or x2 then loop to another indicator to your uh, trip indicator x2 then loop to run indicator or green one for your run position So guys we have the control already this is in your door and this is internal wiring so so we have this control already now it's a little bit bushy but uh, when you do this on your actual wiring it will be arranged properly so we have the control wiring already main neutral and power for the main control then look all the way to your contactor so guys for my next video we will do the uh, practical testing for our motor DOL control wiring is done power is there already power wiring so all we need to do is uh, input power R Y B neutral and the motor DOL motor RYP plus R. So let's uh, move to our testing.